All right, we're a couple of days late, but last week we saw a movie called You're Next. So this is a sort of a late review. We were going to film it, but we had problems with the camera last week, so sorry, no review on time. But here's a quick review. You're Next. Really simple. It's, it's trying to be billed as a horror film. It's not. It's a suspense film. Now, normally I look at these things and I can tell what's going to happen within five minutes. Okay, that didn't change. I knew what was going to happen within five minutes. But there's one thing about this movie that I'm not going to tell you. It was... So that sucked. Start over again. You... Hey, start. Hey, this is me. I know last week we promised you guys to review the movie You're Next, which we did go see. However, we had some problems with the camera, so we couldn't actually get our review filmed in time, so it's a late review. But who cares? Now, this movie... It's being billed as a horror film. Okay, I'll tell you off the bat, it's not. It's a suspense movie. It's a slasher flick. And I know you're thinking, oh, slasher flicks and so forth. I know, I'm not a big fan of them either. And also, for me, I'm one of those people I can figure out what's going to happen within five minutes. In this case, once again, it's true. Within five minutes, I kind of knew what was going to happen. But, this is a big one, folks. Most of these movies bore me. This one, however, I enjoy it. It was well shot. I mean, cinematography was fantastic. The script writing itself, the one-liners that come out of this movie are going to be classics. This is going to be a cult classic. So I'm actually telling people out there, you know what? If you want to go see the theater, go see the theater. But this is one of the things you want to buy when it comes out on Blu-ray. And I'm hoping when it comes out on Blu-ray, there'll be like some extra features like, you know, the person who wrote it talking about it. That's a hint. Uh, also, some uh, you know behind the scenes making of this movie was a low budget movie, but it doesn't feel like a low budget movie. That's what's amazing about this. For me to go to a slasher flick, a suspense movie, and actually enjoy it, even though I've already figured it out, that is good and that is rare. So basically, your next is next on my list for buying Blu-rays and DVDs. So that's it for the review. Catch you next time.